Hey folks, welcome back to Stanley's little office. We're gonna try another path today. All of his co-workers oh, yeah, were yeah. gone. What could it mean? Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. That, uh, Perhaps he had simply me. missed a memo. Oh, please. Are you really just doing this for the <laughs> achievement? Click a door five times. Is that all that you think an achievement is worth? No, 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 no. I Come can't on. just give Keep these merits on. away for give such it up. little effort. Give it up. A measly five <laughs> clicks. Give me my achievement. Come now, on. I suppose you were to click the door 20 oh, times. God's sake. I would say that's the kind of effort that warrants Yo. recognition. Knock, knock. Give me my achievement. Hmm. I have to say, I'm still not feeling the satisfaction of witnessing true <sighs> effort from a oh, noble force. Perhaps 50 <laughs> clicks will do it. Yes, almost certainly uh, No, clicks. no, you know what? I'm done. I quit. Oh, that's just a box. Okay. When Stanley came to a set of two open yeah, doors, go this way today. he entered the door on his left. Yet there was not a single nope, person here. Still either. nobody here. Feeling a wave of disbelief, Stanley decided to go up to his boss's office, hoping he might find an answer there. Da -da 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 -da. Financial panic meeting. Pranking floor five meeting. What to do about four thirty two? Don't tell four thirty two about the meeting. Office party. This box is too small. Everyone is unique. Number of slides on this slide. Charts, slides, charts and slides. Yeah, I saw that slide already. Hey, where's... Oh, there's the projector. Okay. Rate of increasing <laughs> graphs per slide. Please, no more charts, please. <laughs> the boss appreciation specialist, jeez. So this game has kind of struck me as part Hitchhiker's Guide, part Portal, part uh, Monty Python, little bit of Blue Man Group, The Complex, a uh, little bit of off. Stanley oh, stepped into the broom closet, but there was nothing here, <laughs> so he turned around and got back on track. Apparently, there's. Okay, I think there might be an ending there, but we'll Coming take it out to later. Coming staircase, Stanley walked upstairs to his boss's office. Okay, I think we're gonna go look at the mind control facility after. Oh, executive bathroom. Can I? Please? No. Okay. What's this? Nothing there? Stepping into his manager's yep, office, yep. Stanley was once again stunned to discover not an indication of any human life. <clears throat> Shocked, unraveled, Stanley wondered in disbelief <gasps> who orchestrated Shock. this. Unravelment. What dark secret was being held Can I read from your him? memos? What he could not have known was that the keypad behind the uh -huh. boss's desk yeah, yeah, guarded the right terrible here. truth that his boss had been keeping from him. Yep, yep. And so the boss had assigned it an extra secret eight, pin number. Four, Two, five. eight. Stanley was in such a rush to get through the story <laughs> as quickly as possible, he didn't even have a single minute to just let the narrator talk. That kind of anxiety isn't healthy. So oh, he relaxed really? for a few moments with some calming new age music Yes, deploying smooth jazz. I love the narrator. I, seriously, this is ooh, nice candy. Feeling soothed and rejuvenated, ah. Stanley calmly walked forward into the opened passageway. Um. Okay. And this away. And push the button. And down we go. Loading, loading, loading. Keep that office loading. <laughs> mm. 
Descending My cat into the is building, destroying his cardboard Stanley scratcher. He felt a bit peculiar. Mm -hmm. It was a stirring of emotion in his chest, as though he felt more free to think for himself, Yay, I'm to thinking. question the nature of his job. Why did he feel this now, when for years it had never occurred to him? This question would not go unanswered for long. Stanley walked oh. straight ahead through the large door that read No, nope, we ain't going that way today. Facility. Now what do we have here? The lights okay. rose on an enormous room packed with television um. screens. What horrible secret did this place hold? Stanley thought to himself. <laughs> did he have the strength to find out? Um, can I go back? Nope. It's like the Truman Show or something. Employee observation protocol. Unreadable. I hate Monday's coffee cup. How cute. Now the monitors jumped to life, their true nature revealed. Each bore the number of an employee in the building, Stanley's co-workers. The lives of so many individuals reduced to images on a screen, and Stanley, one of them, eternally monitored in this place where freedom meant nothing. Wow. That is Stanley's office. He's 427, right? Yeah. That's this. This mind control facility. It was too horrible to believe. It couldn't be true. It Had Stanley really been under someone's control all this time? Was this the only reason he was happy with his boring job? That his emotions had been manipulated to accept wow. it blindly? That's deep, man. No. He refused to believe it. He couldn't <laughs> accept it. His own life in someone else's control? Never. No. It was unthinkable. No. Wasn't it? Was it even possible? Had he truly spent his entire life utterly blind to the world? Uh, probably. But here was the proof, the heart of the operation. Controls labeled with emotions, happy or sad or content, walking, eating, working, all of it monitored and commanded from this very place. And as the cold reality of his past began to sink in, Stanley decided that this machinery would never again exert its terrible power over another human life. For he beep, beep, beep. would dismantle the controls once and for all. I'm going to um, tweak something here real quick. <clears throat> Excuse me. There we go. There we go. Uh, it seemed I was getting just a... I bumped up the quality and seemed I was getting just a tiny tad of laggity lag there. Console disabled. Ooh! Shiny red button. No, it doesn't do anything. Not history eraser button. What's all this? That's more of this crap, okay. Uh. Mind controls idle, awaiting input. Oh shit, it's Cerebro. Mind control system. And when at last he found the source of the room's power, he knew it was his duty, his obligation, to put an end to this horrible place Danger. and to everything Electric it stood for. Electric shock risk. There we go.
blackness and a rising chill of uncertainty. What's going on? Is it over? Can't see shit, Captain. Yes! He had won! He had defeated the machine! Yay. Unshackled himself from someone else's command. I did it. Freedom was mere moments away. Something yet, is about to happen. Even here. as the immense door slowly opened, Stanley reflected on how many puzzles still lay oh, unsolved. Yeah. Where had his co workers gone? How had he been freed from the machine's grasp? What other mysteries did this strange building hold? But as sunlight streamed into the chamber, he realized none of this mattered to him. For it was not knowledge or even power that he had been seeking, but happiness. Perhaps his uh -huh. goal had not been to understand, but to let go. Yeah, well, just let me out no here longer already. would anyone tell him where to go, what to do, or how to feel. Just whatever just, life can he I, lives, can I please? it will be. You, can, you can't jump. And what? That was all he needed to know. <laughs> it was perhaps the only thing worth knowing. Stanley stepped through the open door. How pretty. Okay. Stanley felt the cool breeze ah. upon his skin, the feeling of liberation, the immense possibility of the new no, path. I'm, I'm on rails him. now. I can't control this it. This was exactly the way, right now, ah. that things were meant to happen. Yay. And Stanley was happy okay so we actually found a real ending yay I beat the game that's it folks thanks for joining me goodbye <laughs> no 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 oh no oh no we're not even close to done with this game yet are we no 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 all of his co-workers were gone yeah yeah what could it mean Stanley <clears throat> decided to go to the meeting room Perhaps he had simply you know, missed screw a memo. You. I'm not going to the meeting room. When Stanley came to a set of two open, 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 Oops. this was not the correct way to the meeting room, and Stanley knew it perfectly well. Perhaps he wanted to stop by the employee lounge yeah. first, just yeah. to admire it. Get me a dollar twenty-five can generic drink. Yeah, sure. Ah, yes, truly a room mm. worth admiring. It had really been worth the detour I, after all, just to spend a few moments if here I in kick this it immaculate, hard enough, maybe beautifully I'll... constructed room. Stanley simply stood here, drinking it Itch. all in. There go. Yep, yep, yep. Okay, we're done. Let's, what's that? Oh, coffee cup on the floor. That's not good. But eager to get back to business, Stanley took the first open door on his left. Okay. Now and so he this? detoured through the maintenance section. Walk straight ahead to the opposite oh, door. Oh, this is something I haven't done yet. Track. Uh, how about no? No, let's go this way. Let's go this way. A little sip there while we're loading. But Stanley didn't want to go back to the office. He wanted to wander about yeah. and get even further off track. That's so right. now, in order to get back, he needed to go. Um. Uh. uh from here, it's, um, left. Oop. Cat just ran into my guitar. Oh, no. Uh, no it's to the right. Excuse Namaste. you. No, 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 not the right. Why would I have ever Is said it, it was to the right? That's this one. What was I thinking? It's clearly... Oh, dear, would you hold on for a minute, please? Now, let's see. We went down this one? right, left, down, this one? left, Yo. right. Yep, yep. Okay, okay, yes. I've got it now. <laughs> this story is absolutely, <laughs> definitely this way. Um. Okay. I just knew that thing was going to run over me. No, oh, no, 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 no. This isn't right at all. You're not supposed to be here yet. <laughs> no, I've this already seen this. I've already seen Click it. It's cool. Close your eyes. Okay, okay, okay I'll just okay, avert my gaze. Back to, um, there we go. Oh, who am I it's, it's okay. I've already seen it's it. It's all rubbish now. The whole story completely yep. unusable. Sorry. How about rather than waste my time trying to salvage oh, this shit. nonsense, 
We'll just restart the game from the beginning. Wait, wait. And this time, no, suppose no, no, no. we don't wander so far off track. Hmm? Oh, come on. Okay. From the top. No. <laughs> no. <sighs> okay. Here All we go again. All workers were gone. What could it mean? Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. Oop, oop, no, not that. <laughs> that's a dead end. Um, I'm standing. Wait. What? Wait. What? What? No, I, no, I restarted. I swear, what I definitely restarted the game. Oh over, shit! Completely fresh. Everything should be. Oh, did something change? Stanley, did you change anything when we were oh, back in that shit. room with all the monitors? Did you move the out? story somewhere, or? Uh, hold on. Why am I asking you? I'm the one who wrote the story. It was right here just a minute ago. I know for sure that it's here somewhere. Oh wow. Well. Okay then. It's an adventure. Come, what? Stanley. Let's find oh, the story. Shit. Let's take this door. Oh, great. All right, shoulder to the wall. Oh, dark and scary. Goody. I'll say it. This is the worst adventure I've ever been on. I can promise you there definitely was no. a story here before. Do we Your just, face is the worst adventure I've ever been on. Again? How about that? Well, I find it unlikely that we'll ever progress by starting over and over again, but it's got to be better than this. No. Okay, let's no. give it a no, shot. No, no, Why no, not? Don't you. Oh. <sighs> is it just me or is the office darker than it was? All of his co-workers were uh -huh. gone. Yep, what yep, could yep, it yep. mean? Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. What? Okay, yep, it's worse. I might be remembering this wrong. It's possible the story is uh, back where we what? just came from. What are you doing? Why don't doing? we go back the other direction oh, and see God if we sake. missed okay. anything? Open the door then, dude. There you go. that before aha I knew huh? we'd miss something the story here it comes this is different no wait never mind not the story okay let's head back the other way and retrace our steps dude Getting real tired of your shit, narrator. Who? What the hell? Now this... Well, I'll be honest, I don't recognize this place at all. Is this the story? I don't think so. This is some Silent Hill I can't Hill quite recall, but here. I believe my story took place in an yes. office building. It, is that correct? Yes, it was. Hmm. Do you remember, Stanley? Yeah. Well, do you know what? Since I've completely forgotten what oh, we were shit. supposed to Don't be doing, you? how about this? You win! <laughs> Congratulations! <laughs> I'm I a winner! You put in a lot of hard work, and it really paid off. So, good job. Oh, no. No, I don't feel right about this at all. We both know you didn't put in any actual work uh, for that win. I'm the one that's doing Some all the walking around fair here. And square, and this was not one of those situations. Excuse you. Okay. I'm getting weirded no, out by whatever no, this place is. No, 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 no. Don't, don't this time. I have no, to no, restart. No, 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 no. <sighs> you son of a bitch. What? <laughs> really? All right. I've got a solution. This time, to make sure we don't get lost, I've employed the help of the Stanley Parable Adventure Line. Trademark. Just follow the line. Trademark. How simple is that? Now watch, it's gonna, it's gonna tee off somewhere. Well, this is new. Actually, you know, I'm gonna play solitaire. Eh, eh. 
<laughs> Let me play solitaire. Detour around you the see, the line knows where the story Yay. is. It's over in this direction. Yep. Onward, Stanley, to destiny. Though, here's a thought. Wouldn't wherever we end up be our destination, even if there's no story there? Or to put it another way, is the story of no destination still a story? Simply by the act of moving forward, are we implying a journey such that a destination <sighs> is inevitably conjured into being via the very manifestation of the nature of life itself? itself? Okay, Stanley, I need to follow this train of thought for a minute. Just stick with me. Now, we can both agree that the nature of existence is, in fact, a byproduct it's too early in of the morning one's for this shit, experience dude, come on. of that existence, right? Okay, now, if my experience of your existence rests inside of mm -hmm. your subjective experience of this office, is this office, in fact, the skeleton of my own relative experiential mental subjective construct? Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, <laughs> that got a bit weird back there. Well, I'd like to apologize. It's been getting a bit sure weird for a while now, so um, you know what? It's, it's cool. I think what we need right now is a bit of music to lighten the mood. Uh huh. Now there is something off the beaten path. Uh, oh my God! Can can we? If I follow the line, will you make this stop, please? Okay, okay, alright, I'm going, I'm going. Whee! I cannot jump over the chair. I cannot walk on the ceiling. Yeah, I know that feel. I'm going to just, um... There we go. Ah, that's better. <laughs> How about no? Whee! No, I can't crawl over the pipes. Okay. Yeah? Yeah, oh, oh, oh. Okay, this is looking a bit scary. Annual reviews, monthly ledgers, corporate imbalances. I'm taking a shortcut. Haha! <laughs> Consolidation reports. Okay, can we please stop with the music now? Oh, pretty. Cut the music. Ah. Go back and look at that. Thank tree. you. Stanley, yes. This fern will be very important later in the story. Make sure you study it it's closely a and remember fern. it carefully. You won't want to miss anything. Yep, it's a fern. It has fronds. It's sitting in a planner. Yeah, okay. It's a fucking fern. All right. Can we go? Wait, but we're back at the office. No. <sighs> No, no, line. You do know we're looking for the Stanley Parable, right? The story? Is any of this ringing a bell? Okay, I'm gonna follow this part of the line. Because I have not been to this part. Can I, can I please copy my butt? No. Okay. Oh, again. Oh, no, 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 not again. Line, how could Trademark. you have done this to us? And no, after we trusted no, you, don't you <laughs> restart on you, me. No, I can't take this anymore. No. To hell with it. Employee restart, fired. Whoa. But, but. <laughs> <laughs> Come on. <laughs> Jeez. Okay. All right, Line. You know what, Stanley? I say what? forget the adventure line. What's it ever done for us? What? We're intelligent people, right? Why can't yeah. we make up our own story? Yeah. Something exciting, daring, mysterious. Ooh, this all sounds oh, perfectly yeah. doable. Why don't we simply start wandering in, well, I don't know, 
How about this direction? Oh, yeah, we haven't been here yet, have we? Now, yes, this is exciting. Just me and Stanley forging a new and path, me. a new story. Well, it could be anything. What do you want Let's... our story to be? Go wild. Use your imagination. Whatever it might be, Stanley, I'm ready Go for this it. Oh, what the hell? Hey! What? Oh, this is bullshit. Oh, wait, wait. How? What the? What? <laughs> what? What's happening? Oh, no, not you oh, again. No. Stanley, I'd also like to veto yeah. the line from having any role in our awesome you tell new that story. Line. No lines or monitor rooms. Just don't acknowledge it, and we should be fine. I'm not, not, not talking to you, Line. Not talking to you. <sighs> Go home, Line. You're drunk. Ah, here we go. Ah, a choice. <gasps> we get to make Yay. a decision. From here, the story is in our control. Yeah. How important we mustn't squander the opportunity. In fact, I believe I need a minute to think here. Okay. Just walk in circles for a minute. Okay. So I know I'm that each gonna door go has to lead the other way. somewhere. Which means that somewhere, the place where we're trying to go, there must be a reverse door what? that leads here. And that, in turn, means that our destination corresponds <gasps> with the counter-inverted <laughs> reverse door's origin. So starting from the right, let us ask, will taking the right door lead us to where we're going? And since the answer is clearly yes, then by all accounts, the door on the right you is know the what? correct one. Another victory <sighs> for logic. Come, Bucket. Stanley. <laughs> our Go destiny on the door on the right. awaits. Open the door. What? Hold up, what's this? Hmm. Hmm. The confusion. Uh. You're telling me that's what this is? It's all one giant ending? And we're supposed to restart the game eight, eight times? That's really how it <laughs> always goes? After a long time, it's Stanley dies. Determined? So now, according to the schedule, I restart again. Then what? what, what, what Am I what, just supposed to forget? What, what, wait. Well, what if I don't want to forget? My mind no. goes blank no. simply because it's written here on this this thing. Wall. No, 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 no. Well, who consulted me? Why don't I get to hey. decide? Hey. Why don't I get a say in all of this? Is it really? Can you? No, it can't be. I, d I don't want it to be. I, yeah. I don't want the game to keep restarting. I, I don't want to forget what's going on. You're I don't want to be the trapped like this. I won't restart minutes. the game. I won't. Do it. I okay, won't well, do it. I won't this. do it. Then open one of these damn doors, all right? And the hey, oh, uh, stopped. Uh, Does that mean um, that doesn't we, sound do good? Did we break the cycle? The um, whatever it is that made this schedule. How would we even know? Will someone come for us? Yo. Will something happen? Knock knock. Yo. So, okay. <sighs> I guess now we just wait. You know, I suppose in some way that this is a kind of story, wouldn't you agree? I'm not quite sure if we're in the destination or the journey. Though they're always saying that life is about the journey and not the destination. Yeah. So I hope that's where we are right now. Find a bookstore, get we'll find out, leave. won't we? Eventually. Well, in the meantime... What, what, what? Okay. Well. All of his co-workers were gone. What could it mean? Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. Is this a real restart? Or is this... Okay. When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his left. This was not the correct way to the meeting okay, room. Okay, I think this is an actual restart. Well, 
Perhaps he wanted to stop by the employee lounge first, Jeez. just to admire it. This game, y'all. Wow. Yes. This game. This room. What a beautiful room. What a gorgeous, gorgeous yeah, yeah. room. Thank goodness Stanley had taken this detour on his way to the meeting room. Life without having <laughs> experienced this room oh, that's was new. now too horrible even to consider. But eager to get back to business, Stanley took the first open door on his left. Um. And so he detoured through the maintenance section, walked straight ahead to the opposite door, and got back on track. Okay. Oh. Yet there was not a single person here either. Feeling a wave of disbelief, Stanley decided to go oh, up to his boss's office, yet. hoping he might find an answer there. Coming to a staircase, Stanley walked upstairs to nope. his boss's office. Nope. But Stanley huh. just couldn't do it. <laughs> he considered the possibility of facing his boss, admitting he had left his yeah. post during work hours. He might be fired for that. And in such a competitive economy, why had he taken that risk? All because he believed everyone had vanished? Yeah. His boss would think he was crazy. Yeah, he's And then totally something crazy. occurred to Stanley. Maybe, he thought to himself, maybe I am crazy. All of my co-workers blinking that mysteriously out of crazy, existence dude. in a single moment for no reason at all. Mm -hmm. None of it made any logical sense. And as Stanley pondered this, he began to make other strange observations. Mm -hmm. For example, why couldn't he see his feet um. when he looked down? Oh, why crap. Why doors close automatically <gasps> behind him wherever he went? And for that matter, these rooms were starting to look pretty familiar. Mm -hmm. Were they simply repeating? Probably. No, Stanley said to oh, himself, no. this is all too strange. This can't be real. <clears throat> and at last, he came to the uh -oh. conclusion that had been on the tip of his tongue. He just hadn't found the words for it. I'm dreaming, <laughs> he yelled. This is all a dream. Oh, okay, that... relief there Stanley felt to have finally found an answer, hey. an explanation. His co-workers weren't actually gone. He wasn't going to lose his job. Yay. He wasn't crazy after all. And he thought to himself, I suppose I'll oh. wake up soon. I'll have to go back to my boring real-life job pushing buttons. I may as well enjoy this while I'm still lucid. Yeah, So sure. he imagined himself flying um. and began to gently float above the ground. Hey. Then hey. he imagined himself soaring through space on a magical star field. <gasps> and it too appeared. Whee. It was so much fun. Space. And Stanley space. marveled that he had still not woken up. How was he remaining so lucid? And then perhaps the strangest question of them all entered Stanley's head. One he was amazed he hadn't asked himself uh -oh. sooner. Why is there a voice in my head <laughs> dictating everything that I'm doing and thinking? Now the voice was describing itself being considered by Stanley, oh, okay. who found this it particularly is... strange. I'm dreaming Meta about a hell voice here. describing me, thinking about Ooh, how it's describing my thoughts, machine. he thought. And while he thought it all very odd, and wondered if this voice spoke to all people in their dreams, the truth was that, of course, oh, this shit. was not a dream. How could it be? Was Stanley simply deceiving himself? Believing that if he's asleep, he doesn't have to take responsibility uh, for um, himself? Wh wh Stanley is as awake right now as he's ever been in his life. Hey. hey now, hey. hearing the voice speak these words was quite a shock to Stanley. After all... He knew for certain, beyond a doubt, um, that this was in fact a dream. Did hey. the voice not see him float and make the magical stars just a moment ago? How else would the voice explain all that? This voice was a part of himself too, surely, surely, if he could just... He would prove it. He would prove that he was in control, okay, that this I'm was go a dream. Back this way. So he closed his eyes gently, and he invited himself to wake up. He felt the cool weight of the blanket on his skin the press of the mattress on his back, the fresh air of a world outside this one. Let me wake up, he thought to himself. I'm through with this dream. I wish it to be over. Let me go back to my job. Let me continue Please pushing the buttons. Please let me push the buttons. Please, it's Please. all I want. I want my apartment and my wife 
and my job. All I want is my life exactly the way it's always been. There's no place like my home. My life is normal. There's no place like home. I am normal. Everything is fine. <laughs> I am okay. Ah, oh, shit. Stanley began screaming. Please, someone, wake me up. My name is Stanley. I have a boss. I have an office. I am real. Please, just someone tell me I am real. I must be real. I must be. Can anyone hear my voice? Oh, Who come on. I? Who am I? And everything went black. Oh. Um. This is the story of a woman what? named Mariella. Mariella woke up on a day like any other. She arose, got dressed, gathered her belongings, and walked to her place of work. But on this oh, particular crap. day, her walk was interrupted by the body of a man who had stumbled through town talking um. and screaming to himself, and then collapsed Shit. dead on the sidewalk. And although she would soon turn to go call for an ambulance, for just um. a few brief moments, she considered the strange man. You okay, Stanley? He was obviously crazy. This man she <laughs> knew. Everyone knows what crazy people look like. And in that moment, she thought to herself how lucky she was to uh -oh. be normal. I am sane. I am in control of my mind. I know what is real and what isn't. It was comforting to think this. And in a certain way, seeing this man made her feel better. <laughs> wow. And she remembered the meeting she had scheduled for that day. The very important people whose impressions of her would affect her career. And by mm -hmm. extension, the rest of her life. No pressure. She had no time for this. So it was only a moment that she stood there, staring down at the body. And then she turned and ran. Bye, Mariella. <sighs> well. Okay, well. <laughs> Covered an awful lot of ground today. So I am going to let this go for now. And next time, we'll come back and poke on some other stuff and see what happens. Thanks for joining me, folks. Bye-bye.